turkey processing. The meat processing process starts with the hanging of stunned turkeys on the escalator, taking them for the next series of processes. When these turkeys reach the neck incising process, their necks are notched, which opens a nerve around the neck that later smoothens the bloodway to flow through. The factory also contains a bird counter that electronically counts the hanged turkeys. Then comes the time for the jacuzzi scalding, which is a process of losing the feathers of the turkeys for the further mechanical process of feather plucking. But initially the tail feathers are plucked. Meanwhile, the turkeys are rotated to the counter-rotating plucker that completely cleans the turkeys, leaving not one feather on their body. After a long process, then the birds are straightened and sent for the rinsing process, which is splashing water on their bodies. After rinsing, the birds become prepared for the hawk cutting, which simply means cutting their feet and separating them from the bodies. All the processes are carried automatically through machines that are specified for each process. Additionally, in the supplication of the evisceration line but priorly, these are escalated through the next litter section. After passing through the next litter section, comes the time for chest opening, which is the only manual process carried out by the awaiting workers. The workers put a linear cut on the turkeys by pushing them in the Thor eviscerator, which takes out the internal organs of the turkeys. The lungs are also separated, because these are people who are so obsessed with it, even they prefer it over the meat of turkeys. This is why the giblet pumps sprinkle water over the lungs and makes them cleaner at the same time while the meat is sent to the cropper. The factory is too cautious about the quality, and that's why it is also given an inspection of the meat. Ultimately, the turkeys get an inside and outside wash, and then their necks are broken and separated, making it another category of turkey meat, and their tails are cut and wasted. Turkey Chicks Similar to other bird farming, the process starts with placing eggs in the incubation, but before placing them, the eggs are checked for their quality with a flashlight. The eggs with the yellowish color are taken out from the tray. It takes 28 days for the turkey's chicks to come out with a centigrade of 100.5 degrees. In the early days, the chicks were fed by the workers. Then, after a certain duration, these chicks are transferred to the factory. Their beaks are colored with a specified yellow gleaming color through a jaw-dropping process where at the start their necks are put into a rolling machine that one by one colors the beaks of each chick. The chicks are fed with starter mash or crumbles. That's a special blend developed for their growth and development. These can't consume layer or breeder mash in pellets, not even when the grains are out of stock. The chicks are called poults and become capable of flying at the age of four weeks, but prefer to stay with their mothers at the age of four months. Though it's very smooth to raise these poults, but unlike other birds, this classification demands extra and intensive care. If you're obsessed with watching more videos about farm, agriculture and technology, please subscribe to our channel with punching the bell icon so you can be the first to get the latest updates. Keep watching, more interesting things are coming up ahead. It takes around six months for poults to grow into a big turkey if they're fed the specified grain between 60 to 100 pounds each day. This classification of bird loves to roam in the sunlight as said before, these are fed with a special category of grains, ranging in various shapes and colors.
With the days passing, these become perfect on the farm and adopt the ultimate shape of turkeys that you and I see with the bald head and all furry. Now, as you can see in the video, black by body and red by their necks is another class of turkey. Turkey's meat contains protein, niacin, vitamin B6, and the amino acid tryptophan. Besides these, it also contains zinc and vitamin B12. The skinless meat of turkey is a lump of low-fat meat and a great engender for high protein. Simultaneously, its meat is suggested for the cure of cancer because of its anti-cancer properties. These are some facts about turkeys. Only male turkeys can gobble. Wild turkeys can fly and wild turkeys sleep on trees. Turkeys can change their color. Their poop is the only element that can help to identify their gender. They have better eye vision, even better than human eyes. And Benjamin Franklin demonstrated turkeys to be bald eagles. Turkeys adore the company of other animals, even the company of humans too, while identifying each other with their vocal voices, which are more than 20 as identified. Like humans, they enjoy the companies of other turkeys and protect the ones with whom they have built a great bond. The turkeys are caught and placed in the square trays. These are packed into several trays to meet the demands. Similarly, these are further sent into various segments of markets where people with the hobby of bird keeping may purchase these turkeys as their pets. While some of these are sent to the meat market, 